Robots are becoming an increasingly common sight in our workplace. Here at Sellafield they have become a vital part of our clean-up mission. Meet our new autonomous robot, the Continuous Automated Radiation Monitoring Assistance, which we call Karma for short. Developed in partnership with the University of Manchester, it's the latest addition to our family and is now being used in our plants for the first time. So the role of the robot is to go into storage facilities and monitor them long term. So with the radiometric tools and it being a, a semi-autonomous autonomous system, it will go around, build up a map of the uh, environment, and then once it has that map, it will then do the same uh, monitoring again and again over weeks, months or years. And then this, this data then can be built up and provide the, to the operator to see trends and patterns that are happening in these facilities. Monitoring for any radiological material is a crucial part of keeping us all safe. Traditionally, monitoring all these floor areas has been done using handheld equipment. But Karma can take on the routine tasks, meaning our health physics monitors are freed up to do the jobs where the human touch adds value. Early doors, we have engaged with the health and physics community and they've been very supportive from, uh, from, from the start and very helpful. We have run countless demonstrations and attended meetings to engage with the end user so that the product we are developing is fit for purpose. Um, it was also very important for us to get the engagement of, uh, of the monitors to accept the technology so that they see this as a way to enhance the way they're working and not uh, an hindrance or taking their job away from them. A lot of the routine health physics surveys we do, for instance surveying floors, um, is quite physically demanding for the monitors. Obviously to use the Karma platform is ideal for that, so that reduces manual risk as well from a conventional safety aspect and again this frees up the monitors to be working in more challenging environments. Sellafield Limited's partnership with the University of Manchester has reaped other robotic rewards such as the Avexis, a mini submarine developed to swim around radioactive liquor. Karma has taken less than 12 months to develop and its design is based on the sort of autonomous machines which can cut your lawn or do your vacuuming at home. You have to remember that uh, we're using off-the-shelf technology that anybody, even in your household, you could get hold of. Uh, and we're applying this in a nuclear environment. So uh, uh, just in terms of large area floor mapping, there's a, a huge benefit to it. In the future, we envisage Karma being deployed in more radiologically challenging areas, for example, spillages, or areas where there are high, known high radiation fields. This is particularly useful with regards to dose control.